Hello everyone, I'm Peter. Today I'm going to unbox the M1 watch. We can see this watch has two colors, black and silver. Then let's open the box. Firstly, we see the watch. And inside there is a magnetic charger and the menu. And also the silver one. Now let's check the outward appearance. This watch is 44 mm. And this side it has two button and uh, here is the microphone. Then the back. The strap size is 18 mm and you can exchange very quickly. And uh, this side there is a speaker. And uh, let's check the silver one. And now let's power on the watch. Firstly, we can check the watch face. We can long press the screen, then the watch face will change. Inside, this watch has totally three watch faces, but it can customize watch faces through the app. Then let's check the quick actions. From the top to the bottom, we can see the control center, the Bluetooth, and about, and the battery level, alarm clock, and the QR code, and the menu style. This watch has two menu style. Then from the bottom to the top is the message notification. We need to connect the watch with the phone. And then from the left to the right is the sports exercise. This watch has totally eight sports mode. Then from the right to the left is the main menu. And this is the night apps view. Let's change to the smart style. So the UI is very same as the Evo W26 and the Evo 13 smartwatch. But this button can rotate, but uh, there is no function. This watch is IP68 waterproof, but I still not suggest to put the watch in the water directly. I have connected this silver watch with the iPhone, and now let's check the functions one by one. First, the phone book. We can go to the Bluetooth setting and uh, go inside one of the Bluetooth connection, then find the sync contact. We can enable the sync contact. Then we can go to here and to click sync with the iPhone. Then we can see the contact is synchronized to the watch. And then the dialer, you can make and reject calls directly in the watch. And the call logs, and the message. For iOS, the message icon is not available. And all those incoming message notification will be shown in the notifier. And then the Bluetooth connection and the steps. You can move the screen from bottom to the top and to turn on or turn off the status. And also check the history and then the menu style you can change here and find the phone and the sleep monitor and the heart rate and the sports exercise and the sports history and the temperature and the blood pressure and the alarm clock. You can add a new alarm here and the, the calendar 
and the Bluetooth music. And you can control the volume in the watch. And the music sound will default come from the watch, but you can set in the phone to play the music sound from the phone and the remote camera and the stopwatch and then calculator and the motion you can check the wake up gesture and then the language if you want to change the language you can click the auto sync and the turn off then you can go to the language list and then the setting that's Bluetooth setting and the clock setting you can change the clock face here and also if you want to change the time and you need to turn the time cycle to off then you can go inside to change the date and time by yourself and also the time format and the new notification bright and the sound it has several alert type you can change by yourself and the volume and then the display we can adjust the brightness and also the screen timeout the maximum time is 60 seconds and the reset and the about and the, then the blood oxygen and the ECG we need to start test from the app in the app we can click the ECG and uh, click the start measuring and now it is measuring we can see the watch is also measuring after measuring we can see there will be a report and we can check in the app and this is the report and the last one is the sanitary reminder you can set the time to remind you to stand up so that's all those functions in the watch and now let's check the app the app is M active it has four page the first page home page is to synchronize the data from the watch to the phone and the second page is a sport page you can click go and the app will monitor your movement it will also use your phone GPS to monitor your position and the third page is the device page we can go to here to connect or unbind the device and find the watch and the most important function is the die push in the app it has several existing watch face and we can just click to install and also we can go to here to select a page in the phone and the synchronize to the watch we can have a try after we select the picture we can click start push sometimes you might encounter this problem you can change to another photo and now we can see the new watch face is synchronizing and the watch is also showing downloading also we can change the text color then the time color will change and also we can change the time position then the time will go to below and also the content above time and the content below the time and the fourth page is the my page it is the personal information and the sports target above is all our details for the m1 watch it is the me watch copy and it has many functions if you like our video, appreciate you can subscribe our channel and like our videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.